I'm content creator Lana DeRue. I empower women entrepreneurs by sharing natural wellness solutions on my show, Steps to Feel Good Daily with Lana. Hi, everyone, and welcome to Steps to Feel Good Daily with Lana. I am really excited to be here. I am your go-to essential oil woman, and I am also an emotion and body code practitioner to help you release those negative trapped emotions that um, hold you back in your life. I am starting, how I start my show always is I do a little oil share, and let me tell you, you are going to be excited about today's show. So just so you know, this is the topic of our show today, how to heal generational trauma using deep emotion release and rapid eye technology with Tamara Lang. I am super excited for you to meet her. I met her, just love her. She's so amazing. So today I chose two oils. I chose Copaiba or Copaiba, however you want to say it. And this oil is is for the it's the oil of unveiling. So it releases things very slowly. So it's very helpful when we're trying to release these trapped emotions. And also Douglas Fir, because our guest, Tamara, is going to talk about generational um, healing, generational getting rid of these generational traumas. And so this is the oil, Douglas Fir is of generational wisdom. So I am going to tell you a little bit about Tamara before I bring her up from the green room. She is a master um, eye technologist. Uh, I think that's one second here. Um, she is a, I think that's what you call it, rapid eye, sorry, a master rapid eye technologist or technician, and she's gifted and um, a gifted facilitator certified in several modalities. So this isn't just her only one. So we're going to talk about a few of them. Um, but she's in the healing arts, and she is the author of three books. I just bought them. <laughs> that bridge energy healing principles and religious language, because we have a tendency to not you know, people close the doors when they don't have an understanding. So I just love what she's doing. So I am going to bring her up from the green room now without any more hesitation. There she is. Hi, Tamara. Hello, Lana. Nice to see you. Oh, it's wonderful to see you again. <laughs> Thank you. Well, I am going to kick this off right away and ask you, what does uh, wellness mean to you? daily wellness. Okay, sure. To me, that's taking care of my energy body as well as my physical body. Awesome. <laughs> I like that. You know, sometimes we don't think about, we don't think about the energy body. We just think about the physical body. And when it goes down, um, I mean, honestly, even when somebody gets their hand cut off or something, they still feel their hand. Why? Because there's an energy body to be dealt with. So I commend you for this wonderful work that you're doing. I um, had a few questions for you. So the first question is, how does rapid eye work help us release stuck energy? Okay, sure. So with rapid eye, we simulate the REM sleep that we do at night. Have you ever seen a baby's eyes darting around in all these different directions? <laughs> yeah. While asleep? yeah. So we simulate that when you're awake and you can con you can let go of these things that are you know, trapped emotions, patterns you don't want in your life anymore. So do you do this with the eyes open? Yes. Yes. The client is blinking their eyes, actually. So a five-year-old can do this. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. And, and you I'm, give me a little sample? Like, well, okay. I don't want, I, uh, they teach us not to do that unless oh, we're okay. actually in like a session. So the technician would have an eye frequency device. Okay. And they would wave it in a neuro-linguistic pattern in front of your eyes while you're blinking. Oh. Yeah. And your peripheral vision picks that up and your brain goes, oh, I know what this is. This is time to release stress because our bodies have intelligence and we know it's out of balance. It's not the technician doing the releasing. Your body has intelligence. Your, your body knows what to let go of. 
So oh. your technician would read a script appropriate for the session. You know, do you want to release fear, anger, anxiety, um, just whatever it might be? For somebody could come to you, they could come to you with a specific issue and say, could you help me release this? Sure. And, and yeah. then you do that because they know themselves, mm -hmm. know how they are. Okay, that's really, that's super interesting. So um, um, how does, is there anything else you want to say about that? I just wanted to say that that was one of the beautiful things about this modality that I love because I got into this field because of my daughter being diagnosed bipolar. And every time we went to a new person, a new facilitator, we had to rehash everything. But in Rapid Eye, we don't have to hear people's stories. We just need to know what emotions need lifted. Oh, wow. So that was very, very wonderful in my mind as a mother. <laughs> right. Well, I, I, I empathize with you because I know I'm dealing with the same thing with my son and going through that journey with him. And it's really a struggle. And working on the energy level is so powerful and so beautiful. So um, I, I, I'm excited, too, to work with you <laughs> on that in the future. I know when you have time because I know you are a busy woman. <laughs> So the second question I had for you is how does generational trauma um, pass down from generation to generation? And how did oh, you even God. know that? <laughs> Dr. Renee Johnson, the founder of Rapid Eye Technology, she's the one that has written books on this. And she's the one that taught me that we have our ancestor stories stored in the DNA inside of us. We have all their stories. So their patterns are passed down. You know, scientists are actually, they have a name for it now. They call it secondary PTSD and things like this. Really? Yes, there's science behind all of this now to support this field of work. Yeah. That's incredible. It's interesting that you say that because one of the feelings that I had with my son is the struggle that he has going on in him. I mean, this is just mother's intuition speaking is that he needs to clear. But prior to us coming to see you speak, saying to him that you are here on this earth to help clear these patterns, this pain, and because you have the biggest heart and you're the one that's able to do it. And then when I heard what you said, it blew my mind. <laughs> it was so powerful. Oh. So, um, so it just passes down in our DNA. So can you tell us about why you, why you use the eyes? Oh, sure. Well, I love to look to the scriptures to understand how this field makes sense for Christians, you know, because yeah. th that was one of my first questions. How does this field fit with Christian belief? Are chi and chakras for Christians, you know? <laughs> <laughs> So when you find those answers, oh, yeah, it makes sense. So the light of the body is the eye, right? That's a scripture in the Bible. The light right. of the body is the eye. And there's another scripture that I love, and it says, there is no work of darkness, save it shall be made manifest in the light. So we can use the eyes to shift these patterns, these stories, these trapped emotions inside of us. It's a beautiful work to use the eyes. Wow, you're giving me chills as as you're saying that because what eyes are the eyes are the window to the soul, and so I mean it's like so powerful that somebody had really discovered this. Um, so my next, you had a sh you had a share, and I wanted to share this. So the steps that you take to um, feel good daily was my question, and you said that you take a minute to structure the water that you drink with your Itericare, which is Scalar Energy Scalar. Therahertz Frequency device. <laughs> yes, I know. That's a mouthful. It's both <laughs> Scalar Energy and Terahertz Frequencies. Okay. Do you have that with, do you have that so you can show us? This is what it looks like. Wow, that's cool. Yep. yep. And I just blow right through glass to structure my water. I usually use a great big mason jar actually for all day long and drink that water all day long. But it, it just takes, I mean, if it was a glass of water, it would only take 15 seconds to structure that water. Really? And you can use that on your body as well? Well, I try to only drink structured water now with the mm -hmm. terahertz charged water. 
Yeah, it's fascinating to me. But the scalar energy you can use on your body as well? Oh, yes. Yes. So after you drink those frequencies and scalar energy internally, you can also mm -hmm. use the device to wand yourself, blow on an area of concern. You can use the 10 points the company recommends to get an overall healthy start to your day or end to your day, help you sleep better. Oh, wow. That's it's, cool. it's really great for inflammation. It oh. excels at inflammation and skin disorders, clogging. Mm -hmm. it, it's known for many things, but yeah. Tricks of the trade. <laughs> <laughs> Tricks of the natural healing world. Tricks of the trade. Yes. I have a little share to share with you. Awesome. Um, so this was... Um, you can use essential oils daily to raise your cellular vibrations of your organs and in releasing stagnant energy. So do you, I, you do use essential oils, correct? I do every day. Uh-huh. So do you add them? I mean, like, do you see that there's any conflict between the energy work that you do or does there a period of time that you should wait when you're using them or is it just good to go? Oh, it's good to go. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I, put, I put three oils on my feet every morning and I use them with clients and throughout the day in my home. That's so great. I Well, I do too. Well, you saw me. I was like, wait, what oils can I put <laughs> to help me to be able to calm down to do the show? <laughs> so um, your feel good trip is structuring the water, enhances cellular activity, improves the assimilation of nutrients, reduces blood viscosity and aids in uh, detoxification. Yes. So Maybe. can you explain that to us? Oh, gosh. My dad was 83 mm -hmm. and he wasn't willing to use this device on his self, but he would structure his water every morning. And he told me, Oh my goodness, I have more brain clarity and more energy just from drinking the structured water. So that was one little, you know, review I got back from my dad <laughs> at 83. Wow. Just drinking the water made that much difference for him. Wow. And it's so nice that we can help our parents because getting uh, aging is not for the faint of heart, right? <laughs> no, my, dad said, it's, my dad said, it's not for sissies. <laughs> no, it's not for sissies. Growing old is not for sissies. <laughs> so uh, my tip for the day was if you're using citrus oils like lemon, lime, or orange, and any citrus blend, that that's going to up uplift your mood. So lemon is the oil of focus, which of course I used before doing this. Um, and if you're lacking in joy, lime is the zest for life. And that's if you're feeling apathetic and wild orange is the oil of abundance. So if you're lacking in energy or you're feeling scarcity mode, that would be a fabulous oil. So before we end, I wanted to ask you, what is your mission? And I wanted to show these um, lovely books that you have done. Thank you. And um, and then if you let us know what your mission is and how people can reach you. Oh, sure. Well, my mission is to help Christians understand that chi and chakras and all the principles used in energy healing do fit with Christian belief. They're in the scriptures. Prophets have talked about these principles. People have told me I'm a bridge. <laughs> help people understand. Connect the dots. Because, um, you know, in the world of energy work, we use certain vocabulary terms. We're talking about the same subjects using different terminology in religion. So I've connected dots for people. I really, I really appreciate that because I feel like so many people are missing out on the gift of energy healing just because they don't understand it. And it is, that's what we are, spiritual beings, right? <laughs> yes, yes, we are. <laughs> so oh, we didn't really mention deep emotional release. That's what my second book is about. Oh, okay. how to do um, generational clearing through the eyes yourself. So instead of going to a rapid eye technician, you can learn to do this release work on yourself or with others. And I teach the steps how to do that in in that gold book, that second in the book. gold book. Okay, that's the one that I am reading. That's the one I'm reading right now. <laughs> oh, well, I have I have this one. I haven't, and I'm finding it fascinating. So I'm super excited. I mean, yeah, I just, I love it. And then this, this book is, that was the other one. That, that was the know. one I wrote first. Yeah. Yeah. All the foundational principles are in the first book. 
Okay. So this is how people can reach you, right? Yes. I thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I will drop you into the green room and um, come visit you in just a minute. <laughs> oh, okay. Awesome. Thank you for coming. Thank you. <laughs> Oh my gosh, don't you just love her and her work? Her, I saw her speak and her soul is so bright, so beautiful, and she just wants to make good in this world. And I am Lana DeRue. I will give you a free emotion a releasing sample session and a free consultation if you go to my website, happyhealing.me. And you'll find a lot of other information there. And until next week, um, be happy, be healthy, and enjoy becoming who you came here to be. More about my services and products at happyhealing.me. Make sure to join me every week on the SWE Media Network YouTube channel and wherever you listen to podcasts.